As a producer and the writer and director of Blue Journey, I developed the film to be a piece of contemplation reflecting on domestic violence. The idea came during the lockdown. I concentrated writing news articles that the number of assaults in the home had increased drastically. My goal is to bring to life films as a way to investigate society's issues and give them a place of importance. As the cinematographer of Gallardo, I felt that the script lent itself to a really distinctive visual style and had so many opportunities for me to push my own abilities. I wanted the cinematography to reflect the narrative tension in the lighting and framing. Gallardo was ambitious and challenging, practically and conceptually, so I hope that the cinematography reflects that. This project has built my confidence and broadened my interest in cinematography outside of genres and projects I would have ever imagined working in. As a director of Libra, my goal was to discuss body image issues within the queer community and artistically portray those vulnerabilities. Libra is a celebration of the experiences a queer body can go through, both positive and negative. As a filmmaker, my passion is ignited by creating and documenting meaningful stories. And I hope to carry on directing and producing more stories like this that touch people's hearts. Editing Libra pushed me creatively as a filmmaker to create a structure that contained a gradual build of pace and rhythm with music inspirations. Being influenced by experimental film and having a subject matter that is open-minded promoted me to enhance the narrative visually. Having this platform allows me to help people tell their stories that are yet to be told in such a way. Directing shares a connection with editing that I will most definitely aspire to unite. As the director of Undertide, I showcase my passion for screenwriting and directing. With this project, I want to explore the reality of a struggling young adult through film. My goal was to create something that can resonate with the audience, particularly with the people who are going through similar situations. I enjoy the process of transforming work on paper to an actual film on screen. Being a part of Tom I Heart as a sound designer was an amazing experience, as it gave me the opportunity to be able to create a world and tone with unique characters and emotions through sound. I found that this heartfelt comedy with its hints of darkness very appealing. I would love to create similar movies in the future and potentially then move on to some horror then after. What excited me the most while doing cinematography for I Exist Because You're Here was that I could see all the visuals in my mind the moment I read the script. Filming for this project enabled me to explore my creativity as well as the more technical aspects of cinematography. Being able to bring all the images in my head to life and create beautiful shots solidified my decision to continue my life transforming words on paper into a visual medium understood by all. I'm a passionate emerging director and cinematographer, always looking to improve my skills by creating exciting visual stories. Being the cinematographer for Undertide was a fantastic opportunity to put into practice my visual narrative style. And I'm very happy with the end result. I believe this is the beginning of bigger projects in the future. I'm the writer and director of I Exist Because You're Here. I'm mostly inspired by people and the absurdity and simplicity of being human and the brutal flow of emotions within. I guess that's what I want to achieve with my work, make people feel something. I believe in the power of transformation the cinema has. It's about being constantly fed by the process, constantly learning and exploring the connections between what I see, hear and read. My main interests are directing, screenwriting and cinematography. Writing this year, I wanted to venture out of my comfort zone by creating an exciting coming of age adventure that sourced elements from Southeast Asian culture, my culture. The most inspiring thing to me is when one writes and creates work that truly represents the heart of a culture. And it's a struggle, but it's something I've grown to love and plan to keep growing towards achieving. When the opportunity came to edit Gallardo, I knew that this was the challenge I wanted for my final year. Because of all the personality and passion involved in the project, everything needed to be proven. Having to edit thinking X plus Y equals Z before inserting a cut, but also needing to feel the pace and be engrossed in the tone. It was a test of patience, but it was really fun. This is my future, piecing fragments of a vision and bringing it to life in a DCP. I wrote and directed Thor My Heart, a comedy drama which focused on the themes of isolation, companionship, and personal growth. I've always had a love for film, particularly in the areas of compelling storytelling and cinematography. The script was inspired by my own struggles during the lockdown. 
The film is unique because it blends comedy into the bleak setting of a world gripped by a pandemic. Film has always been my passion. Whether fiction or doc, the creative process, specifically directing, fills me with a true sense of purpose. Storytelling has been paramount to society from the dawn of existence, and the ability to pick up and carry this torch should be a true honor to all who have the opportunity. As a cinematographer of Blue Journey, I thought the story was interesting and liked the idea of telling a narrative from the perspective of a man whose perception of the world is skewed, not everything he sees is reality, giving us an opportunity to create some interesting visuals as his delusions begin to cave in on themselves and reality begins to sink in. I'm the writer and director of Gallardo, a transcendental pulp war movie inspired by the rhyme on the ancient mariner by Samuel Taylor Coleridge. My purpose with Gallardo was to intertwine a war movie and a cigarette TV commercial. For this, I combined different aspect ratios in both color and black and white, staying true to Joyce's precept that style and substance should be synonymous. I strongly believe in the ecumenical value of cinema, and that's what I want to exploit in the future. I am the producer for I Exist Because You Are Here. It is about an elderly man who has to deal with the loss of his wife and also a pandemic as well. This story is about struggle and loneliness. What drew me to this story was the romance of it and how the main character had to deal with losing his love. The kind of films that I'm interested in making are romance and coming of age films. In the future, I'd like to produce more films about romance and how people deal with true love in films.